In this example, we use VLOOKUP uh, to merge two data tables using exact match. So here's the uh, context. In a small company uh, where there are just six employees, uh, we have two data tables. One is um, their phone extension. So in column B is, uh, is the name field, and column C are the numbers, extensions. In another place, and I just put in, uh, in column G and H, there's a table about their uh, functional area. Now suppose we want to merge these two uh, tables together. Um, we cannot just copy this table and paste it to, um, to the first one because if you look, the names are of different order. Plus, this manual uh, steps um, these kind of steps are always discouraged because it will uh, it is very uh, error prone. Um, so the, what do we do? Well, it turns out if you look, we look up, it can do a terrific job in this. Uh, let's see how it works. So uh, let's just say uh, I use the first record as an example. If we um, use this as a base, or we could actually uh, start a new worksheet and uh, uh, just starting with a list of names, that will be fine. But let me just show you how do we just use the names to grab all the information. So here I type VLOOKUP um, we look up value. Here we want to look up the person uh, named Tom. And where do we look up? We we'll go to the other table. Okay, and uh, I press F4 to absolutely reference it because I want to use it to letter uh, formulas. And uh, um, I want uh, Excel to return uh, contents in the second column, the, i.e., their uh, function uh, function area. Uh, and uh, that's two. Now, finally, here, um, do we want to exact match or not? Here we do, because we do want to match person by person. Okay, so I here I type false, meaning that we want an exact match. All right, so let's press enter. So it grabs, it finds Tom, goes to this sheet and finds Tom on the last row, return whatever uh, that is in the second column of that row, so which is uh, accounting. All right, let's double click and see if we got it right. So Alan is active here Elena finance Liz accounting and the duty sales so this way let me just type division give it a, a new name so um, so this way we were able to uh, basically merge uh, two databases uh, into one using the exact match